哎、欸、，Hi folks， 呃、uh, ，don't don't know what that flashing is， 呃，啊 ，Right， okay， seems to be alright， 嗯、um, ，I、uh, On the bike ride yesterday, on through the、uh, Wandle Valley in Morden Hall Park, we always ride on the boardwalk, and I accidentally took this bit of video. And I'll keep repeating itself.、Um, there we are.、Um, this is the inspiration to many of my Norfolk paintings. Now this is in Norfolk. This is in South London.、Uh, I'll just touch on that.、Ah. Get off.、Uh, you can see that that pond seems to be in several of my Norfolk paintings,、um, but that's the actual view. No houses. The houses are way behind those trees. So, but I like these trees. So I'm going to do something based on that.、Uh, right. I'm using acrylic, as you can see. We've got、uh, vermilion and ultramarine. Bit of Payne's,、uh, bit of、uh, burnt sienna. So I just squeeze out a bit more of that. Ooh, there's not much left in there. I'll have to go to to Hobbycraft, I think. I, I usually buy these off of、uh, on eBay, but they've they've cancelled my account for the second time in about two months. No explanation whatsoever. Uh, so we've deleted the accounts and eBay, and we will go back to it in six, in about fifty two, fifty three days, and start all over again. So I'll be giving Amazon my money, not you, eBay. Trouble is, eBay takes、uh, PayPal and Amazon doesn't, which is a bit of a nuisance. <coughs> so、uh, here we are. So we've got some paint spray, some cadmium yellow pale, some yellow of raw sienna. So let's get a bit of a sky in. I'm going to do this as quick as I can, because I want to see Prime Minister's question time.、Uh, right, okay.、Uh, so nice brush. This is、uh, heavily gessoed with、uh, a bit of、uh, black and white gesso. I'm gonna have a little bit of a vet gel. That's this stuff here. It's it's a cheaper version of、uh, of、um, the extender, the artist's quality extender. Right. So a bit of white, a bit of a、uh, bit of ultramarine. Just, just get it covered. The great thing about acrylic is it dries very quickly, and you can paint over it quite, or you can amend it. So I, I, I like those trees in the background, but I also like the colours of that marsh grass. A lot of it's been cut down. It's not rural. It looks rural, but it's not. I can assure you, it's, it's a bit of suburban London. But we have a lot of parks, and I'm very fortunate. Right, keep going. I do that part, of course. That's the、uh, the model for my Norfolk scene scenes. I did one the day before yesterday. Obviously, too tired after the bike ride to do any anything yesterday. But I want to see Prime Minister's question time. So I might have to do this in.、Uh, A couple of videos, which is a bit of useless, but just right down the horizon there, and then we're gonna go in with some warmer clouds. Right, look. Let's get.、Uh, let's put that brush in the water, and we'll get a. Nice white and a bit of raw sienna. Oh, just just whack away. I do this with oil as well.
Tu vas peu pas si elle vient. Hein? Tu vas bien, tu vas bien, tu vas bien, tu vas bien, tu vas Okay, we can leave some of that just so shining through through the dry brush, or sort of dry brush. Okay, we'll get some trees in there now. I uh, got a tree brush. <coughs> uh, These lovely gradual brushes are really, really are nice. I've got a large one. Go. Uh, a flat. I'll go there. This is a, a short flat, so here we go. Uh, now we're we're in the depth of winter here, but this if you would think so, it's a beautiful day. It's about 10 degrees centigrade, which for this time of uh, winter is uh, pretty good. Uh, uh, right, I need some more white to just uh, white uh, titanium white. So there's my titanium white, big big pot, half a litre. But it's, oh, ooh, it's hard to get off because the uh, paint dries. Because I keep it pointing down, it keeps it airtight. Don't put too much out because that's expensive. I'm using my uh, lovely camera, the uh, Panasonic V770, performing very well. It's taking time to download, but I've changed the resolution from uh, uh, let's get uh, some, some red, blue and yellow. We need, we need to put in some, uh, this is just background, because we want a, uh, some uh, rigor work on some of this. A little bit of ochre, a bit of that. It's not ochre, is it? A bit of paint's great. Now, I want that dark on that horizon, so we're going to use a bit of Payne's grey. Going to let some of this dry off a bit, it won't take long. Now I'm going to do some uh, filigree in there. And I'll get brush the brush. I'm, I'm tending to go uphill there. I must change them downhill, so let's get that. You want dark if you're painting light so that the tips of those uh, grasses will uh, actually. Give a great contrast. Well, that's the idea, anyway. Uh, okay, so let's keep that brush separate because I'm going to wash these in water when I finish. Um, I'm using my one of my lovely brushes here. Look, they're worn out, but look, they do lovely things. So we want a uh, good uh, oh, look, it's so easy this technique. 
feel free to copy what I do. Don't put you put my signature on, right? And don't copy exactly. Make your own version of it. So this is a horizon sort of grasses. And uh, then we'll come forward a bit darker than that with some burnt sienna. And now you can see that that, that contrast between light and dark, very important. Oh, let's just put a few random ones in there. Okay, now we're going to go a bit darker for the mask. Now I noticed it wasn't that dark looking over the pond. So we'll have some burnt sienna with a bit, bit of Payne's grey and a bit of, bit of the old gel. Uh, Just darker than that with a little bit of paint grey. Sorry about the battle. There's that pond in the front. It's lovely because the, the schools go there and take the children and they do the nature study. Fish a few of the uh, pond life out. And then they, because they put it back. It's slightly darker now, I think. Cover it all. Dark and grey, I would have thought. Yeah. It's actually, it's actually, but well, I'm not using my photograph or my video I'm just doing this from memory because it's the light on the top and then it's, it's still light because it depends on where the sun was shining from get some burnt sienna in there uh, just get a little bit darker in the foreground because we're going to put some uh, sunny Water up there. That will show. If you don't remember, I bought a pack of 15 of these bristly brushes from Hobbycraft for about eight pounds. It's bound to go up now because everything's going to be pushed up, isn't it? Because they always could be a knock-on effect trying to get back to normal after COVID. Right, OK. That's, I might even put a little bit of green in that. I'll do that later. So let's get a bit of a of a, some paint grey.
these lovely trees here just stippling. Right, well, let's uh, put that in the water, let's go to Riga. Uh, right, now we want a bit of dark now. And now there's absolutely no colour in these, so they're just. I'll get it to a wet enough. Keep your brush sort of wet but not dry in any way because this is quite risky for expensive riggers. I'll go put some more green in front of those because they're not going, not to. Uh, Clean brush, I'm going to go back on those front of those trees now with a bit of dark. Bit of dark. Uh, just a, a strong green. Paints, I'm using paints clay with this. Okay, I'm gonna just put a bit of Payne's grey I think on on here because this it's got to show the twigs at the end of the branches. It's a very gentle touch. Nearly there. cover up things you don't like. Uh, I might even use a pen. Uh, a bit bouncy so let's just tighten it up a bit. Don't need any more of that gel. I don't think. Uh, let's do that pond now. Now we've got a lot of light shot the reflection but this comes down quite a quite a way so find my lovely or one of my lovely brushes. Make sure you 
shake the water out of the ferrule. I always say this, but I'm sure the, 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 the bristles only come down to about there in the, in the ferrule and the handle hardly goes in there at all, just beyond those little pins. And when those pins fall out, just bang a, a veneer pin through, snap it off and bend it over with a hammer. It you know, last for years. OK, so uh, we want... Uh, let's get a bit of that uh, blue. Quite light blue. And now we'll put in the dark reflection. some of those uh, stems to show uh, let's get that reflection down so that that sky colour will show up a bit Gel. Just get these well, it's sort of working, uh, but I can tell you that it was very dark. We studied that reflection. That's me and my pals, uh, us old men riding our bikes badly. Uh, Going to have a cup of tea halfway and. Come back. Got to put some fronds here. All right, let's get that. Just a nice light, light bluey white. Okay, uh, sort of shows that reflection. All right, go back to that. Uh, right, a bit of a green. Just this stuff sort of going all over the place. Similar to what I did the other day. Uh, I was going to put some green in here, wasn't I? So there are some sort of uh, some greeny things in that grass, plus the, the pet anaconda. Right, I still need a bit of that colour, that nice yellowy. Rigger. 
The one I did the other day, somewhere on the broads I've sold. Uh, that's a. Uh, I will mention the camera. I paid three best part three hundred and fifty pounds for it. So if anybody wants to help out with the expense of that, that's more than I earn from Patreon and eBay. And that's out of my pocket. So if you'd like, if you want to feel generous, please feel free to <laughs> send a pound or two on PayPal. It wouldn't be much appreciated. We're eating bread and butter. <laughs> no, not really. I'm only joking. Um, I'll put. The, I'll see if I can get a, get a signature on there. I'll put it in white because everything will show up. There we are. Uh, I think I could probably just liven that sky up a little bit. Just cleaning my rigger. I hope this is not this video is not going to, going to split. Uh, right, let's get in there. A bit of sienna. But bit, bit of sienna is really good mixed with white on in skies. Okay, we'll let that go, put it in the mount. Uh, let's take, I'll leave that on. I'll probably have to minimise the picture. Well, there it is, more or less of what I was I was uh, showing you. Uh, let's just get that up there. Oh, come down that corner. Look at that horizon. Horizon. Right, okay, well, here we are. Let's, uh, there. So we've, we've used a bit of red, a bit of blue, a bit of burnt sienna, a bit of paint grey, a bit of cabin yellow pale and a bit of raw sienna. So one, two, three, four, five, six colours. I, I need to have used the, the uh, red because I can make my greens from the paint grey and that cabin yellow. But there we are, I hope you like it. I probably could have got a little bit more light across there but that's all in shadow, isn't it? Right. Thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye bye.